In the heart of Detroit's 8 Mile lies the city's biggest and baddest pawn shop. Do not touch You won't believe. You're fired. What's in store? My kid could have got killed. Right now on Hardcore Pawn. Call me a little bit extra motive. We're not interested. Y'all just bull****, just bull****. Let me tell you what I'm gonna say. Get up. Oh, yeah. Got a birthday curve that hasn't been signed yet. I got an old care. Month, got a can of beef stew. I can't do anything with this stuff. I have a car, a limited edition Monte Carlo. Holy. Oh yeah, I got a pawn that too. You have more than that? Yeah, the grill. But you're looking about a hundred. Some customers don't take no for an answer. This is very wait, 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 wait. Can you give me five hundred for my ring? No. Why can't you just give me five hundred? Because I can't just give you five dollars. It's silver. It has to weigh over 30 grams in order for me to help you out, sir. It doesn't weigh enough for us to take it. So what's the deal? He wants me to take my jewelry off and put it with his so I can give him more than $5. Five bucks. Five bucks. I'm sorry. That's all we can go. We're just not interested. Five bucks. We're not, we're not interested. You know what? Why don't I meet you in the front? Here you go. I'll meet you right here. When customers start getting loud at the window, the only option that I have is have them move away so it doesn't get everybody in line out of their mind. Because when one person starts yelling, everybody starts yelling. It's like yawning. Here you go. Thank you. So I can't get uh, like nothing. Nothing. nothing for it. Nah. We're ain't not nothing gonna work. We're not interested. Can't nothing go with it. I don't know what else you got to go with it. I ain't got nothing to go. With. I'm asking y'all for something to go with it. We don't do that. Sir. How y'all ain't gonna do this? Oh, American jewelry and loan. Take my jewelry and loan me a little bit extra for it. Y'all just bullet, just bullet all around this mother. Thank you, sir. Can I sit back and chill? No, he can, he can go. I can't even get, get I can't get a little bit from that. Hold on, man. Let me say what I'm gonna say, man. Can I say what I'm gonna say? I'm gonna say it outside. Can I say what I'm gonna say? I can't get what I'm gonna get for it. Nope. I can't I just can't off this motherfucker. I can't get what I'm gonna get for it. I can't get what I'm gonna get for it. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Bullshit. Don't let you go off the game, Parker. Any way, don't nobody get no damn any way. Sir, are you done? A little bit for a little bit. You got two earrings in your Does ears. Does it matter? Just take it off, put it with mine a little bit, let it get a little bit more weight to it, and go ahead and give me my okay. money. Does that make sense? Yeah, it makes sense. Nobody takes advantage of us. When customers get irate, we have no option. They have to go. That's bull. That's fine. That's bull. Okay. Nobody need that any way. What do we got? It's a um, music box table made in Italy. Okay. And it plays music. Made in Switzerland. But you said it was Italy. The yes, the sticker on the bottom. Yeah, it's Swiss. Okay. Um, no, I don't buy that. Why not? Ain't nobody gonna buy that. Why? Who won't listen to that? I, I don't know. That's why you wouldn't purchase it? No. Maybe if you had some Jeezy playing on it when you open it or something. But other than that, no, you ain't gonna sell it. Right. I, yeah, I bet I agree with you. How'd you get it? I bought it at an estate sale, actually. That's so how long cool. have you owned it? I've had it for about four years. How much are you looking to get? I was hoping for about 150 and how did you come um, up with that amount? Well, I've seen them for two forty nine, so this one's really beat up, like really beat up. What's the least you take? Well, I was really hoping for a hundred. And what were you thinking? I was thinking fifty. Really? Well, would you do seventy five? Maybe I'd go fifty. Fifty? That's it? Really? Personally, I wouldn't give you anything for it. Oh. It's just too messed up. Yeah. But, you know, the future of American jewelry is standing right in front of you, so <laughs> I'll go along with whatever she says. Okay, you know, I'll take it. Okay. Let's buy anything. <laughs>
It sounds right fair. That, it, she's very fair. Yeah. She'll probably piss, pissed at me. I <laughs> won't yell at her in front of you, but when, when we go in the back, she's a little too fair, to be honest with you. <laughs> go right over to this one, though, and okay. Ms. Fair will take care of you. Okay. All right. Making me feel that way on a sales floor, like, don't underestimate me when I know what I'm doing. And I know about music boxes, and I know this is worth something. It's a good piece to have. 20, 40, and 50. Thank, Thank you. you. I paid $12 for it. I made $38, so I'm pretty happy. Did you really buy that? I didn't, Ashley did. And so you just allowed it to happen? Well, you know, I think it was a good deal. So when are we selling it? Greg the Ray. He saw us, he loves us, he can't frequent us enough. He even went as far as staying at the motel next door just so he could be here the next day when we open up. Rich, I was supposed to talk to you about some items. You are? What kind of items are you uh, bringing me today? Well, I got a birthday card for a friend of mine. It hasn't been signed yet. This guy comes in here every day, multiple times a day. Some books, some brand books. new books. They're $21 what? a piece. I got yeah, an old mug that business. I'd like to pawn off. <laughs> when you brought this stuff to me last week, what, how much did I Here's say I was going to be able to go? a brand new wallet from my company. Never been used. I don't have any money to put in it, so I might as well pawn it. <laughs> Is that all you, that you have Wait, for me? Got a can of beef stew from the dollar store. You know what? I've been it's looking been for, a pair, uh, for a nice can of that. that for a buck? I can't do anything with these, man. Salt and pepper shakers? They're porcelain. Just like last week, I can't do anything with oh, these. But I have a car. It's a 2002 limited edition Monte Carlo. Oh, yeah. I got to pawn that, too. First things first, I got to get my title for my car. Dude, you know I want to help you out, and I want to get that car and pawn for you so you can get your shit together, but uh, I can't do anything with this stuff. He brings a bunch of trinkets and things that, that he talks up to be really cool. Um, they're not, so I'm shocked. He has a car that we would take in to pawn. Get that title so we can get things oh, rolling, yeah. okay? Y'all can't give me 500 for my ring? No. Well, why can't you just again? give me 500 Because I can't just give you 500 uh, Holy good. that's good right there. Stop. Get away from the control. I don't want to shake your hand. See you later, alligator. You're the alligator. I'm a gorilla. You are. had this in here before as well? Yes. She previously had it alone for $220. She came in this time wanting $500. I have to move and I'm laid off. I just really need the $500. I'm coming right back to get it Monday. You know one's missing. I can give you 325, 330. That's, you know, that's pushing it. That's really not gonna help me. Okay. Y'all can't give me 500 for my ring? No. That's not gonna help me. Right now, Detroit's going through some really tough times. People need money. You try to help as many people as you can. The problem is you can't help everybody. That's sad. Somebody come in here and spend their money and you can't. I don't know. I don't have your receipts. I'm just dealing with the item that you're saying, pawning me. You're I'm just dealing with the item. Why yeah. can't you just give me 500 Because I can't just give you $500. Why can't I can't just spend so much money with y'all. That's not right. I, I can't give you something that it's not worth the money. Yeah. Have a good day. What was the least she'd take? 500, that was it? 500, she was not willing to budge anywhere under 500. I was giving her another 100 on top of it. You can do. She'll be back. What year was it? Not what it was it, it is. What is it? 2002 limited edition Monte Carlo. 2002, that's too much information at one time. The car's blue book was 52 or 5,500. I'll tell you what, let's go take a look at it. That's what I asked you to begin with. Hey, slow down. How you doing, sir? What's your name? I'm Carlos. Carlos, nice to meet you. I have some material things that I would like to find. Okay. Detroit police officer found out that my license was suspended. They had my car impounded. Now I have to find the money or means to get the car out. You have more than this? Yeah, right. the grill. I saw the grill when you first walked in. Let right, me right. grab some paper towel. This grill has been sitting in his mouth. He probably eats in it. There's food stuck in it. It's disgusting. You have a custom made, obviously. How much do they hate you for? 
800. 800? I want the best that they have, because this is my mouth. You have acetones in there, and I want to drink sometimes. I want to smoke cigarettes sometimes. And I don't want to wake up and see when I go, it's not, it's not blinking. How much are you looking for? I'm trying to get $1,000. And if they can't give me that, then I may go somewhere else. Grills are custom, so essentially it's worth scrap value. For the grill, you're looking about 100. Jackie, you're looking about 25 bucks. You said 25 dollars. Look how many coats I have. You see how That's many coats very, I have out here? This is very insulting. Wait, wait, wait. You couldn't go right. in the store and say, "Well, I got 25 bucks, man. Can I get this coat?" I, I can tell you what I can offer you, and if you don't accept that price, then I'm sorry that I can't help you out. Some customers don't take no for an answer, and that was this customer. Just well, be honest. Be a man and just be, be honest. Be a man. It's not, it's not about it, manning up to anything. It's about manning it. up that I have a business to run. Is there anybody else I can talk to? Because obviously, you don't even understand what I'm saying. So, so you actually want to actually, I actually like insult to it. talk to someone else. OK, why don't you talk to me? You want 25 on your coat? Why would you ask me $25? That's I, I wouldn't you ask want. you. I'm going to tell you. Here's the deal. If 25 will help you, we'll be more than happy to help you with 25. So we got $25 is like a quarter on the ground compared to To me, $25 I mean. is a lot. So much money, why would I be trying to get some? I'm sorry. I'm if really sorry we can't help you. I don't want to get Thank you so much for coming. I don't want to shake your hand. See you later, alligator. Thanks for no, coming. No, you're in. the alligator. I'm a gorilla. You are. Have a nice day. All right. He created a little bit of a scene for us. We don't appreciate it. If he comes back in, he needs to come in a little more humble. Holy this guy's got a license. When you Very good. That's good, right there. Stop. Get away from the controls. Jesus. Oh, there's a lot of stuff in here. Can I get in? Sure, drive around. I don't, want, I don't want to Just drive Just don't around. hit anybody, or else you'll give me less money. You living in this thing? Yeah, I told you I'm homeless. I'm homeless than I used to be. Holy <laughs> There's a bunch of stuff that I bought. I thought you were joking. <laughs> <laughs> You're making me nervous, dude. Right. I have a title. You have the title. Where's the title at? Somewhere in my dresser somewhere. All right. I'll go to Secretary of State. Or in the back seat. Do you, is oh. this what you call your dresser? The back seat? <laughs> OK. Bring me the title. We're going to we'll work something out. We'll work something What's out. What's the very least that you can take on a loan? It's a stumper. Give me 30. Keep going 3, down. 3,500. Keep going down. 27. Keep going. 29. No, you're going the wrong way now. 2150. Can you get under two? $19.99. OK, maybe we'll work something like that out. I'm going to go get the title right now. I'll be back with the title. See you. Give me the title, and I'll see you tomorrow. All right. I'll be surprised if we ever see that title, if it ever comes back here. But I'm sure Greg will come in with a whole bunch more that we don't need. Holy $50 or $40? I'll take the 50 Good idea. Can I borrow 10 bucks? Ashley? <laughs> No, I know the ball. Where the ball? No, I'm trying to find the guy that's supposed to my TV. I ain't seen that guy yet. Jesus Christ, come on, give me a break. Hi, yeah, may I help you? I was trying to buy a TV, Miss Lady. This guy comes in with his son causing a scene. And the next thing you know, he wants to buy a TV. Something like this. That's what I'm trying to find. Okay, well, you found it. I don't know what it looked like. Want me to get it plugged in for you so you can see it? Yes. Okie dokie. All right. Trust me and show me. I'm. Please. I'm doing it. I want to see if it works on channel three. But that's all I want. OK. Now I'm saying, how much you want for it? That one's 100. What? 100. You must be crazy. You don't lost your mind? Hey, I ain't got but 50 bucks. OK. It's going to be smaller. No, I don't want nothing smaller. OK, then you can have that one for 100. I don't want it. Yeah, let it be small. I'll take it. OK, OK, small. Let it be small. Oh, no, go, go, go. I'm go, going. Go. Oh, my god. I'm not going to go out like that. <laughs> I got it. Yeah. All right, I got this one for you, sir, for 50. Okay, you want to see it plugged see. in? Let me see. All right. 
How was your day today? Oh, my day is fine. Good. Ain't got what? I ain't got to pee on myself. What? That's what I said. I ain't got to pee on myself. I'm doing fine. <laughs> hey, who loves you, baby? Are we good? Yeah, that's what I want. Perfect. I'm good to go. You know how to grab that money, don't you? Well, I'm going to go get your receipt written. Just waiting for Damn, me. that woman know how to grab that money, boy. She grab that money before I get it out my hand. Can I, I have a product? I will. No tip today? Nope. I'm gonna give my mama a tip. Okay. Think I'm gonna give you one. Okay. I enjoy the place. I like it. Guess what? It's enjoyment. I think this guy just woke up in the morning and felt like dancing in a pawn shop. Here you go. Now who loves you, baby? Have a great afternoon. And thank you. Thank you. I'm, go I'm going to get my TV and call it. Great. Do, 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 do. <laughs> And it makes me feel so good to see somebody so happy. Because not all customers come in happy. They want money. Don't drop it. Oh, yeah, if you drop that song, bitch, I'm going to be mad. Thank you, and y'all have a blessed day. The son of a gun weighs a ton. Greg's back with more useless stuff. I'm sure we're never going to see that title. How much did you want for it? $50,000 or better. Thank you very much. All right. Always gave me more than two points. I'll go for 350, but that's the highest I can go. Boy, that son of a gun weighs a ton. So here we are, three hours later. Greg's back with more useless stuff I can't do anything with. I'm sure we're never going to see that title. Oh, I don't know if I want to put it up on that glass. Yeah, it's probably in the middle. How heavy is it? Well, about 36 pounds. I don't know. It's pretty heavy to me now. 36 pounds? Well, I don't know. Northern an electric and manufacturing company. I'm told it's from 1906. Somebody told me this is very exclusive because it was probably in a hotel or a, that's something back then that they would write on. Does this open up in any way that you It you're does. Aware? It has the key. Oh, boy. What are you asking for this? I would like it back, of course. I would need as much as possible on this. Uh -huh. If I have three months, I have a lot of bills I have to pay. Sure. Probably Money. I'm looking at right now as a loan. I'd have to say in the $750, $700 range as a loan. But I would be willing to take, if I can get it back, $300, $400 right now. All right. I'll tell you what. Let me do a little research on this myself. Give me a second. OK, sure. I was willing to give you before you walked out of here, 3.30, and now I'll go up to 3.50, but that's the highest I can go. But you always gave me more than 2 .20. Okay, so let's go, let me go check. Let's meet me at that window. I'm gonna check your account. Let me see. I cannot believe she's back in already. 275, right? I mean, thought it was 375. No, it was 275. I can't. For real? Yeah. yeah, for real. Seriously. I really gave you the max. At 350. I guess I gotta take it. That's 75 more dollars than you normally get. You're obviously a good customer of ours. You haven't lost anything, so I appreciate your business, and that's why we can go over that for you. Thank you. I was really happy that I was able to help her. I didn't want to lose her as a customer, and I'm really happy she came back. 20, 40, 50. Thank you. So Thank you. All right, let me tell you what I found. Yeah. A little research on this phone. Okay. Although I couldn't find this phone, I did research the company. They are out of Canada. They were established in 1885. I found the phone very similar to this by a different company with really? a buy it now for 350. So how much did you want? If you could give me up to the value of what you think it'd be, would be great for me. If you could do 400. Are you kidding? No. Oh, you found this for how much, 300? I found one for 350. Okay. Similar, so, you said similar. Looks exactly the same. Okay, how about uh, 200? How about 100? 150. 100. 100 is a deal. Thank you. And I, and I have 30. Uh, you have 90, 90 days. days to get it back. It runs you four bucks a month. Three dollars interest and a dollar a month. Beautiful. Store. Okay, so come up to the front. We'll take care of you here. How much did you want for it? $50,000 or better. $50,000? Come on.
So Today I'm here with this ball. I was watching TV yesterday and found out a Bay Ruth ball went for $260 plus thousand dollars. I would expect maybe $50,000 or better for this. It's a Lou Brock ball. My mother gave it to me. It was given to her. She told her the ball would be worth $50,000. Let me get my resident expert in here. He knows more about this than me. Dennis has been collecting sports memorabilia for 30 plus years. He's, a, he's been into balls for a okay. long time. All right. He is my expert go-to guy when it comes to sports memorabilia. Well, you know what? I saw that a Babe Ruth ball went the other day well, for $260,000. Man, I mean, this is Lou Brock, brother. You know what's worth more than the Lou Brock signature on the ball? What's that? Ball is worth more than than actually the signature. Really? Yeah. The ball itself, it's a Charles Feeney ball. Charles Feeney was the president of the National League. Um, I believe it was in the 60s, maybe. If you could find this ball unsigned in a box brand new, it'd probably be about 150 bucks. In a with box with the new. signature is less. <laughs> You gotta be good. Yeah. Well, I, I I think I'll keep that for myself. I mean, if that's an original Lou Brock signature. It's a Lou Brock signature. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep it for myself. Thank you, gentlemen. For not a problem. Thank you very much. All right. My mother gave me this ball. I mean, I'm not gonna part with this for, I mean, $100, $200, even $1,000. I mean, I'll keep it myself. Maybe one day it won't be worth $50,000. When people bring something to us and it has intrinsic value to them, and sometimes when you can't help them, don't be mad at us. We just can't do it. Sorry.